बहुत सारा सामान है ब्रो आसपास इतने सारे Oh my God, the word is not coming on my mouth. What is that thing we were doing? Acrylic painting? अरे यार, fluid art, fluid art. Hi, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. For today's video, I'm doing something super exciting. In another one of our episodes of Sarah's Honest Review, today I'm trying out Indian YouTuber brands, and I'm giving you my honest thoughts about all of these brands. I have five brands to share with you all today. These are brands of some of my favorite YouTubers. These are YouTubers that I watch on literally a daily basis. So we are not really going to talk about their content today. We are going to talk about the brands that they have started, which I think is such a huge milestone to be a creator is one thing to create content and produce content is a whole different journey together and i feel like we don't often see the behind the scenes i try to take you all through so much of my behind the scenes vlogs because i want you all to see that there's so much that goes behind content and then after that starting a business of your own is a whole different milestone to achieve and all of these women have done that plus these are all women owned business so i love that for them most of these are purchased by me and some of it is pr so i will tell you as we go along each brand one at a time and i will tell you what i think about it what my favorite items from them are because as a consumer when you're purchasing you can't always purchase because you like the youtuber you also have to purchase because you like the product although i am a little biased like that and i go ahead and buy because i love the youtuber also like i just want to take a moment and talk about each of these businesses one at a time so that you all have a clear idea and in case you did not know any of these businesses you also get to know them i think this is done so much abroad like almost every single creator abroad does have their own merchandise or their own brand but in india we don't have that much yet in the market so it's very exciting to see all of these women like pave the path and lead the way for us and with that let's dive into today's video but if this is the first time you've come onto my channel then hi i'm sara i mean beauty and lifestyle content here on youtube if you're new here take a moment hit the subscribe button and join the sara squad i'm sure you'll have a great time here and also don't forget to hit the bell icon right next to it so that every time i upload a video you get notified and with that let's dive straight into this I would say I'm starting in no specific order but I feel like I'm starting with one of my personal favorite brands and that has to be Skion Apparel and Simba Lifestyle. This is uh, the jogger suit set that they have from the tie-dye collection. Now as a whole Skion Apparel and Simba Lifestyle are two different brands but they are retailed on one single website. It's owned by Mridul Sharma. So the apparel brand currently only has tie-dye collection. So this is their tie-dye crop top. This is in the mint and cream color and I got a sim a jogger pant uh, like a matching jogger pant for it she also has hoodies in this particular variant there are three colors there's tutti frutti there's mint and cream and there's also pink color if i'm not wrong uh, but the pink one did not have my size i did not really want the tutti frutti because that's my least favorite anything to have in my mouth and uh, mint and cream kind of is a very cute color to have plus the material on this is so soft i love the fabric on this i've already worn this crop top more than 7 8 times because it's so easy to like it's such a basic piece it literally screams my name the tie dye material the tie dye quality everything is spot on i've got the size medium in the top and in the pants i've got the size large and it fits me perfectly both of it fit me really well i will leave my size references for you in the description box so you can have a look in case you want to order plus i love the little detailing that she does with all of her things because mridul is the queen of aesthetics and she does everything with such a like intimacy that you feel like yeah you're owning something that's created by mridul herself because uh, on this it says a warm hug made out of cloth and it has a heart on it it i just like really like these small small things and the next item i have from them is this planner right here this, this is their for the record 5 year journey planner so it's basically a planner that you can have for 5 years it has every single date on it and a question with every date i think it's so unique i've never seen anything like this initially when i bought this i bought it with the intention to film this video because i bought these things this is not pr and i thought that i would not really be interested in writing something every day but the questions that she has curated for every day is so unique and so nice and so thoughtful that just the whole idea of it is very like heartwarming because you know that you will be flipping through this every day and you'll be flipping through it for the next 5 years and in 5 years you're going to grow so much as a person so you can see and you know actually reflect through every year because there are like 5 years over here and one question so you have to answer this question. question on this day every year and i think i love the idea of it i've already started filling it all the pages are 
are not filled because some days I slack but uh, and I also did not buy it at the beginning of the year but I think it's a very great journal to have it's still just March so you can get your hands in it you have the rest of the year to fill it out and you have the next five years to fill it out plus she again has a very thoughtful note over here and a thoughtful note inside as well which is you know from her everything handwritten in her very classic Mridul font and I love the quality of the binding like this is some good quality binding happening so five years ago you don't have to fall you know I know कि ये स्टडी है और ये रहेगा एंड सिंबल लाइफ स्टाइल की ब्रांडिंग भी बहुत ही क्यूट तरीके से इधर है सो जस्ट द होल एस्थेटिक एंड everything about Simba Lifestyle and Skewan Apparels I love I know they have more things as we speak today I think she's launched her macrame planters just today itself I saw it on their Instagram so that's new and I know they have trunks and a lot of other things and their website is also updated abhi plus their shipping is super good because this reached me within a week's time so yeah everything about this brand is my absolute favorite next let's talk about a beauty brand that has become one of my go-to's when it comes to color cosmetics and that is cuffs and lashes so so they have a lot of things over here and uh, some of this is PR and some of this is bought by me. So this is their first palette. This is the ethereal palette that says 20 something and it has this particular color combination going on right here. I've not really tried this one out yet. So let's talk about the next one that I have tried out and that is the cuffs and lashes and shy styles palette and this one I have also reviewed in one of my videos. So this has like a faux beauty board kind of thing going on like four colors and this palette it is really worth the money because it has a lot of beautiful shades for you to select from the formulation on every single one of the eyeshadows is bomb like the mattes are a little especially the blue palette the mattes are a little difficult but when it comes to the warmer tones the mattes are good the shimmers are really good the shimmers are actually very well pressed as well because she has another shimmer palette as well which is the stardust palette which is only glitters like pressed glitters all the way through and this one i tried for the first time yesterday but it did not go so well i tried the shade ursa it wasn't the best like it was not sticking on so i really have to play around with this a little bit more to give you my honest thoughts about this one then they also have their colored eyeliners which are very good especially if you want to try out colored liners and colored looks on a budget they have some good quality good pigment eyeliners the pink one is one of my favorites the blue one is a little watery it's not the highest pigment but the pink one is a nice hot pink color and shows up really beautifully and they are like 200 to 90 bucks or something and then this is definitely their star product this is their cover pot it's like a concealer foundation or uh, Corrector sort of situation. They have a lot of shades for you to offer. That's great. They are very inclusive. They have about 15 to 18 shades if I'm not wrong. Plus corrector shades as well. I got the shade 11. This is still a little neutral undertone for me. So I need a shade darker than 11 as well. But it's super pigment alright. It's like full coverage pigment. If you use this, it's gonna cover everything. Your tattoos and you know, like really Huda Beauty foundation coverage. But at like a 250 pricing. So that's insane. I think with cuffs and lashes the best thing that you're getting is amazing beauty on a budget uh, I definitely think that when it comes to creativity it's a little lacking because some of their products are very heavily inspired like the ethereal palette is kind of very much a copy of the Jaclyn Hill uh, Morphe palette and also the cuffs and lashes and shy styles is very much a beauty glazed color board palette kind of inspiration but when it comes to formulations I think it's definitely worth your money because it's it's not very expensive at all it's very budget friendly and you're getting bomb formulations like you will be paying worth your money like every single penny of yours will be utilized in this brand and that's what I love plus a lot of variety like so much color like now if I want to play around with color I just reach out to the cuffs and lashes products because it's literally screaming my name these days and I want to play around with color more because there's so much variety they have to offer this is literally not even their inventory they have so much more and even if you don't want to like buy makeup you don't want to buy color cosmetics something you must try from them is their brushes this I highly 100% recommend this is their brush holder case that came with the cuffs and lashes and shy styles collection and these are a few of their brushes that I have that I have not tried out yet but I have so many more brushes which are already in use that I'm using on the daily basis and they are bomb.com all the fibers of the brushes are super soft like very luxurious quality they don't even fall off if you're washing them your hair will not be falling off the brush and they 
are very precise like we have the numbers written on them they are very precise in application you have a stippling brush you have a powder brush you have a contour or uh, eyeshadow brushes so much variety on such great prices you can buy them individually you can buy them as a bundle and i've been saying she she and i forgot to say who this brand is owned by so cuffs and lashes is owned by nidhi katia she's a super boss woman and she has this amazing brand that i'm so surprised like i did not even know about it till so many of you all actually asked me to review their products review their products and i actually reached out to the brand and realized that Dude, she has so much on the on her inventory. Like there's so much going on on the Cuffs and Lashes website, and not only that, they retail other cosmetics as well. So all in all, they retail like Mars and Swiss Beauty and Miss Claire and all the affordable makeup. Plus, she has her own brand. So everything about Cuffs and Lashes is. I love it. I just I I'm honestly in so much in awe of Nidhi as well as the brand. And I definitely think if there are two things you must try from the brand, it has to be the brushes and the liquid eyeliners and also the cover pot concealer, but only if you get your shade in that cuz a couple of shades are out of stock. So just see that you get your shade and that is also a must try. Okay, next we have to talk about SJ Merch which is owned by the OG Queen Shreya Jain, my one and only true love in the beauty YouTube community. Honestly, we all love Shreya Jain. Who doesn't like Shreya Jain? Like Is there a single person who doesn't like Shreya Jain? I mean, you're not normal if you don't like Shreya Jain. And she owns SJ Merch, so I think she launched SJ Merch two years back, if I'm not wrong. And I was one of the people who was standing in queue to order as soon as she launched, and I ordered something from each and every item that she has. I even have the OG SJ Fam T-shirt. You know what? I'm gonna like search for it. It's in my drawer. It's there. I didn't sit with it because it's not available anymore. Yes, baby, OG SJ Fam right here. So this was like one of her first. launches where she launched a couple of t-shirts and she also launched mugs and notebooks i also have the notebook right here so these were her first launches if i'm not wrong ye sab abhi nahi hai website pe like all of this is gone and now she has like new collection but this was how she started and i think for a year she did not launch anything else she just launched this but all of her stuff are re like really good quality you can see i've owned this shirt for more than 2 years now and the fabric is super super soft like honestly it's very different like इतना अच्छा कॉटन ना मैंने आज तक कोई टी शर्ट में नहीं देखा है एंड प्लस द रबराइज प्रिंट दैट दे हैव ऑन टॉप इतनी बार धोने के बाद भी वो कभी गया नहीं है सो दैट आई रियली लाइक द क्वालिटी ऑफ एस जे वॉच इज रियली गुड वेन इट कम्स टू फैब्रिक्स एंड द मग लाइक दिस इज माई पेट एंड कॉफी मग आई ओनली ड्रिंक इन दिस कॉफी मग सो यू मस्ट सी दिस अर लॉर्ड ऑन माई इंस्टाग्राम स्टोरी सो दिस इज ऑल्सो नॉट अवेलेबल एनी मोर एंड शी हैड नोट बुक्स राइट योर सो दिस आई डि नॉट लाइक द क्वालिटी ऑफ दिस दैट मच बिकॉज इसका ये जो ऊपर का लेयर है ना इस पर काफी मेल बैठ जाती है लाइक यू कैन सी काला पड़ गया एंड एवरी थिंग बट आई हैव यूज दिस नोट बुक सो मच एंड देर आर कपल ऑफ मोर नोट बुक दर आई हैड फ्रॉम हर विच आर लाइक ओवर एंड आई एम स्टिल लाइक आई हैव दैम बट मतलब भर चुकी है पूरी पूरी बट लेट्स टॉक अबाउट वॉट इज न्यू फ्रॉम एस जे मॉच राइट नाउ एंड दैट आर कैंडल्स सो शी हैज सेंटेड कैंडल्स राइट नाउ एंड आई हैव दीज टू वेरियंट दैर इज फ्रेंच मैक्रॉन एंड दिस इज सीलियन लाइम so this comes in this very beautiful glass uh, packaging and it has this gold um champagne sort of spotted uh, bottle detail and sj merch is a sticker on top it's not like engraved or anything personally speaking i would have loved if the sj merch was just like written in a different font like i don't like the logo of the brand that much but that is me being like really nitpicky to find something wrong with it because apart from that as a candle overall this fills your room completely like i don't have a very big room but if i just burn one of this my whole room will be smelling beautiful and smelling of that fragrance in literally about 5 minutes time like 5 minutes of burning the candle and after 15 or 20 minutes if i blow out the candle it will still linger on the scent will linger on for a couple of hours so i think the longevity of it is really great plus if i'm not wrong she also has now three wick candles which are bigger so you can like buy the three wick variant if you're very confident about that fragrance i had to buy the single wick because tabhi tak wo three wick wale launch nahi hue the and also with fragrances i like to play around and see if i'm liking one because i get a headache very soon so amongst these two my personal favorite has to be sicilian lime because it's a very beachy and i don't know how to explain you know it's very fresh like sicilian lime is fresh and i like a fresh fragrance 
French macaron is a little too sweet for me, so I don't burn this very often. I will be burning this one the most, but these are also really, really cute. They come as a duo, and if I'm not wrong, they retail for $2.99, but I'll flash the prices for you right here. And one of my favorite things about SJ Merch is that they are very um, kifayati on the pricing. Like, pricing is not at all, like, exorbitantly expensive. Everything is, like, very, like, reasonably priced that you can get your hands on it, plus all made in India, and everything, I think everything is made in India, even since bar even ski on even cuffs and lashes and so is sg merch everything is made in india and the next brand we'll be talking about is debashri beauty which is owned by debashri banerjee and this is another beauty brand i have done a dedicated review video on the debashri beauty eyeliners so far they only have one launch because this is a fresh brand it's just launched a couple of months back so they have only one launch by now and that is the water activated eyeliners my personal favorite amongst all of the shades that they have is this one right here which is a nice vibrant yellow color it's the shade delicious uh, so it's very vibrant very pigmented and looks beautiful especially when you have brown skin a nice yellow popping eyeliner looks very good and yellow eyeliners are not very common in the Indian market so I like that about this they are a little tricky to use so I have explained the entire process of how to use them and you know how much water you need how to use them how to get the best use out of them in that video each of these is retailed for $8.99 if I'm not wrong but you also get bundles I can't wait to see where Debashi plans to take this brand because when it comes to beauty we don't have a lot of creators yet making beauty products because there's so much that goes behind it you know with quality control and so much that goes with uh, making makeup so like producing makeup and doing all in India I can imagine how much goes behind it so I can't wait to see what else she launches but so far if you want to know everything in depth about these then I believe you should check out that video because I've covered everything much in depth for these eyeliners over there and last but definitely not the least we have my darling Helly Wade's classic in so she has her stationery as well as her apparel everything is retailed under the classic in itself the stationery from the classic was PR so let's talk about that first because this uh, is a new and fresh launch so these were the notebooks I believe she sent me three and I gave one to my friend and one to my mom to use and this is the infinite possibilities notebook that I am currently using it's a very staple blank notebook that we have over here it's not ruled at all and it has a very simple font over it it has a blue and white like a what is that thing we were doing what is this that I did so kya bol rahe the when we were doing it in uh, lockdown all of us were obsessed with it Aray yaar, fluid art, fluid art. Yeah, so it has a very fluid art of print going on on the book. Damn, my brain just freezes us sometimes. And it has infinite possibilities over here. She has a variety of notebooks. I don't know the exact pricing, but when it comes to the classic, everything is super, super affordable, very affordable pricing. And these are great, especially if you don't like to plan as per dates or you don't really want rules and, you know, ruling lines at all. So for what I use this is like to just pen down my random thoughts. Like this is something I keep at my bedside table. And whenever I have some spontaneous idea for a video or something that I have to do and I really will forget if I don't write it down then this is like my go-to thing that I just take this and I write it down so that is somewhere I think such a notebook comes really handy she also launched her planner this year and this is what the classics planner looks like it's a very colorful yet basic planner it has a very like heli wave aesthetic to it like you know with these vibrant pop of colors and it has a soft cardboard packaging and inside the planner we have a couple of things going on so of course I have not started using this because I have a lot of planners in use right now which is why I haven't been able to do justice and really flip through this and see that how I can utilize it because I'll be very honest with you all when it comes to such planners now I'm like um, lazy ho jati hu. like mujhe har din likhne ki aadat nahi hai. only the days I have to give like appointments or meetings or something that I have to schedule then I need a planner and for that I already had one so I could not put this to use but this one is actually perfect for someone like me who doesn't like to write every day because she doesn't have a dated planner as such it goes as per months there is a calendar you can take appointments over here and then there are directly months there's your January I had started writing in January and you did directly flip and there are blank pages so you can just fill up your January you can fill up your Feb March and all of the months and straight away at the end she also has these cute stickers going on so it's the right amount of cute with the right amount of 
practicality because ideally if i had this planner before i would have gone ahead and bought my ink bucket one then i wouldn't have bought that one cuz ye wala main zyada use kar pati mujhe har roz likhne ki aadat nahi hai itni sari cheeze bharne ki aadat nahi hai and isme ekdam right amount of things are there like there is a habit tracker or mood tracker but it's not every month it's directly at the end of the year only and uh, there's bullet journaling as well so if you're interested in that if that's your jam you can do all of that these are terminologies that planners use like ekdam meghna type ki philosophy ये यू नो मेघनाथ चैनल इफ यू बिन देर दैट शी डज अ लॉर्ड ऑफ दिस बट ये सब मेरे बस की बात नहीं है तो हम ये सब में पढ़ते ही नहीं है बट दैट्स वर्ड हर प्लानर लुक्स लाइक हर प्लान इज ऑल्सो सुपर अफोर्डेबल इट्स सम वेर अराउंड सेवन हंड्रेड एट हंड्रेड एंड देन लेट्स कम टू द क्लोदिंग सो वेन कम्स टू क्लासिक आई ऑर्डर टू थिंग्स दे हैव पोलो शर्ट्स दे हैव दीज बेसिक शर्ट्स एंड दे ऑल्सो हैव ड्रेसेज टू लेट्स फर्स्ट टॉक अबाउट दिस ब्राइट रेड शर्ट दर आई कॉल दिस इज समथिंग दर आई यूज लिटरली ऑन अ डेली बेसिस वेन कम्स टू बेसिक टी शर्ट इट्स कंप्लीटली माई जैम I'm like this is what I wear to college. This is my practical. Like college, maybe pen sakte, ghar mein bhi pen sakte. It's very practical, very useful, and the cotton on this is super good. It says it's premium combed cotton, and I've got the size medium, which gives me a baggy, oversized uh, feel. and it has a very good quality fabric this is a kind of fabric that i wouldn't say is 100% breathable because you know when you get sweaty and like if it has to absorb your sweat it will not absorb like immediately but uh, it's not like exactly it's not very sheer so it's very opaque and uh, good quality thick and slightly warmish it's not very breathable and hoisery material to bilkul nahi hai so it's good quality cotton but then when we talk about the dress i'm not a huge fan of the quality of this dress because this fabric is not the same as the t-shirts fabric so it's that very different sort of a patla cotton and secondly it's very ill fitting cuz it did not it's the size large and i saw the size chart and i ordered it it's like not fitting well in any way like this portion if you can see is just too big for a large size and uh, also it's like very short so i definitely don't think is something i can wear there is no structure to the dress overall so i just feel like with the dresses plus i'm not a very big fan of the fabric i really like the color and i was hoping that this fits me well because it's a very cute midi dress and looks really cute on heli in the picture so i was hoping that it looks that cute on me but it did not give me any good fit so i'm not a very big fan of the dress but when it comes to stationery on a budget as well as good quality t-shirts and there's nobody like classic so that completes everything i had from these five indian youtuber brands i love seeing indian creators do this hopefully one day in the future we will have our own very brand let me know in the comment section if that is something that excites you and let me know what is it that you would expect me to create of course these are youtubers that i already know and love and watch and so i already knew these brands existed but i'm sure there are a lot more indian youtuber brands that i don't know about and if you know of them then don't forget to leave them in the comment section and i would love to do a part to and try them out for you if you like today's video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up for today's video the sara squad shout out goes to ashlyn nazareth thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel if you want to be a part of next video sara squad shout out you know what to do hit the subscribe button bell icon right next to it and also leave a comment down below saying hashtag sara squad and you get a chance to be a part of my next video sara squad shout out i will see you guys very soon in another video bye guys love you Mwah.